<laughs> anyway, we worked there for a while, but we didn't really make a lot of money because I don't think they really liked our routines. So we left and we started working for this escort service. But we mainly we just gave massages and lap dances. I mean, Starship would throw on a hand job for good faith. Where is she? <laughs> How is she supposed to be? Hello! Ah! Hello, come on out to the stage. Welcome to Theater Therapy. I'm Gary LeClant. Hi. Hello. I'm Starship with an I. I'm Starship with a Y. Great. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Welcome, please have a seat and we'll get started. Do we have to sit on the same couch? Yes, everyone sits on the stage in theater therapy. Oh. So we, uh... Okay. I'm going to sit the way that I don't usually sit. <laughs> going to sit that. Um, we're going to oh. begin. Here. Thank you. See, she's already kissing your ass. <laughs> she's just being considerate. <clears throat> now I'm being considerate too. <laughs> what was your name again? Uh, Gary, uh, Dr. Gary LaPlante. LaPlante? Yes. Like plants. Because I love foliage. <laughs> well, uh, it's actually French. Yeah, la plante means the plant. Oh, French. Yes. I love French. Stop. <laughs> we used to be in a French techno band. Do you want to hear a song? No, I, I think we should like get, get, get down to... Um, why don't we just start with... Meow, 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 Song. It's, it's good enough. Good. Okay. Good. 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 You're hiring me to create some unity between whatever's going on here. And in ther theater therapy, one of our tools is uh, an item which we will use sometimes. We'll, we use a pen. And when the pen is pointed at one person, one person will talk, and when the pen is pointed at another person, the next person will talk, okay? So why don't you... Um, it's really a big pen, isn't it? No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a byromite. Now, um, what I'd like to... Do... What? He's a thespian. He's not a thespian. Yes, he is a thespian. Are you a thespian? Oh, yes, of course I'm a thespian. See, he doesn't like girls. <laughs> thespian means actor. Why don't, why don't, why does it say thespian on your car? Yeah, why don't you like girls? I do like girls. I very much enjoy, I love girls it a lot. It says thespian. Because thespian means actor. Now when the pen is pointed at one, one will speak. Why don't you tell me your take on the relationship? So you're not a fag then? Uh, no, I'm not gay. I enjoy velour. That doesn't make me gay. I, <laughs> I like velour too. So we all enjoy the lure. Good. No, no, Let's... no, no, we don't all enjoy the lure, okay? <laughs> Someone here doesn't like the lure. Someone likes cotton and is just pretending to like the lure. You know what? <laughs> Starship fucked my entire career up as a professional actress, and therefore I can no longer be friends with her. Okay. She's the ball in my chain. She's the clank in my choo choo. Clank. Can, can I say something? The pen's pointed at me, Starship. Yeah, but the back of the pen is pointing at me. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. It's multi directional. It is not a multi directional pen. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Why don't you just tell me the most recent thing that you feel Starship has ruined for you? It's her stupid seizures. Okay. And, and how, how have those hurt you? Physically? No. How have they ruined your career? Well, we had this audition for Black Hawk Down. Black Hawk Down? That's, really, that's an amazing movie. No. no. Black Hawk Down. <laughs> anyway, during the audition process, just as we were getting to the most pinnacle point of the sides, when the black cock goes down and we have to take our clothes off to bring it back up again, Shaky in the corner gets one of her stupid Parkinson's disease seizures. And I'm left standing there like a huge idiot. <laughs> Is she really having a seizure? <laughs> Are you done? I can't help it. Okay, I was born that way. You see, I have um two tumors between my brains, and it makes me have seizures. You know, you gotta be a little bit more compassionate and understanding. 
Jeremy from my new Mornell. No, it's Shaky Zippet. <laughs> That's a little me, okay? Now, why don't we just try and get you to communicating on a non-verbal level, okay? Maybe kissing. Or why don't, why don't you just tell her? Why don't you just tell her how you feel about her? If you could choose a color, Starship, any color, what color would you tell your friend how you feel? It could be any color in the rainbow. Pink. Pink. Do you see that? Pink. Yeah. Feel that. It feels good, right? Yeah. Surrounding you with pink. Good. Now, if you could tell your friend how you feel by sound, any sound that you could give her, the sound of chimes or whatever, what, what sound would you make? Pomegranate. <laughs> <laughs> That's a fruit. Okay. So a sound would be a really good like a whistle or a bell or a... Giraffe. She doesn't know our sounds from her animals. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Yes, I do. <laughs> uh, you don't. Know. Yes, I do. Apparently not. Well, you're red with meanness. You're green with envy. You're yellow jaundice. <laughs> you're orange because you eat too many carrots. You're orange because you went too much Mr. Candy. You need to exfoliate. <laughs> you're wearing way too much wet and wild eye makeup. <gasps> I could make it to the mall. My business card ran out. We got to work later. <laughs> 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 a theater game is nothing without uh, mining, and I'm going to show you guys a game that always works. It's called the Rope of Understanding. Okay, so Starship, why don't you imagine that there's a rope coming from your heart, and take that rope out and feed it. Give it out to your friend, a rope. Good. Now look at this. She's offering you... Her heart. There's no rope there. It's an imaginary <laughs> rope. It's a rope who really loved you. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Imaginary. Like if your dad didn't ever really have sex with you. It wasn't that bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. And then we're, we're taking the rope because we're friends. We were friends. And friendship is, come on, we're grabbing it. We're grabbing take it. The rope. Okay, see? Take it and pull it towards you. You see, friendship is about give and take. It's about taking and giving. And it's fun. Friendship's fun. <laughs> see, remember how this feels? Right? You see?